Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, welcome in here to to Rover Sports tonight. I wanted to uh, get 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 some thoughts out about the San Francisco 49ers real quick. I wanted to do it here on my podcast, and I wanted to talk a little bit about Quinnen Williams and Nick Bosa. So Quinnen Williams, uh, Quinnen Williams is obviously a talented football player, University of Alabama. Really, really good player, really talented football player. But now I got I got to be quite honest with you guys. Quinnen Williams is the best prospect that I've seen come out from the defensive line group in in a really long time. I mean, Q Williams is an absolute stud. He's an absolute freak of nature. He is an unbelievable football player. And Nick Bosa is similar to his brother, brother Joe, Joey Bosa. I mean, when you look at uh, Joey Bosa play the game of football, Joey Bosa is a guy that, honestly, Joey Bosa has a couple of um, has a couple of uh, deficiencies uh, when you look at uh, when you look at his play. Joey Bosa is a guy that it has short arms, so he has short arms for one. Joey Bosa also is not explosive off of the edge. Joey Bosa takes advantage of tackles that don't have large wingspans. Joey Bosa's wingspan is 32 inches. That is not elite in any category. Joey Bosa feasts on guys that are not as talented. And there are plenty of tackles in the National Football League where Joey Bosa can get sacks and opportunities. But the San Francisco 49ers have brought in D Ford. You selected Solomon Thomas with the third overall pick. You need some speed and some punch in the middle of that defense. I know you have DeForest Buckner, but Quinnen Williams is damn near the next Aaron Donald-like prospect. I mean, this guy is so intelligent. This guy diagnoses plays so quickly. And he is so rare, and he's able to sliver through and get to the quarterback whenever he needs to get to the quarterback. So Quinnen Williams is absolutely the pick here. There have been guys as talented as Bosa come through this draft. If you get a Bosa, there will be games where he goes against an elite offensive lineman, and both Solomon Thomas and Nick Bosa get shut down. But I really look here at... Quinnen Williams is being an absolute rock star. I look at Williams possibly getting 12 or 13 sacks. If you listen to guys, if you watch guys come out of college, Quinnen Williams has the athleticism that 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 Aaron Donald possesses, that the best pass rusher guy in the middle has. He's like a Fletcher Cox, and he will get to the quarterback. Ask Tom Brady where he does not want to get pressured. He doesn't want to get pressured up the middle of the field in his face because that is when Tom Brady is absolutely at his worst is when you pressure him in the middle of the field. So right now, Quinnen Williams has to be the pick for the San Francisco 49ers. He has to be the second overall pick. And I completely and totally am for Quinnen Williams being selected here for the second overall pick to the 49ers. I don't want J- Nick Bosa because Nick Bosa is going to be inconsistent. He only has a 32 inch um, he only has a 32 inch wingspan, which is very low. It puts him in the bottom 25 percent of the NFL. His get off isn't that great. He won't be able to just outrush you via speed. And tackles with long wingspans that are athletic and very have very sound technique, Nick Bosa won't be able to do anything. Nick Bosa and Joey Bosa, the way that Joey Bosa gets his 10 sacks is he feasts on bad opponents and bad offensive lines. He relies on technique. He does have good bend when necessary, but Bosa is not going to be able to get around the edge, and he's not going to be able to... Uh, j- just go and speed rush like a Von Miller, like a Bradley Chubb. He is not going to be able to go and speed rush, not even like an Olivier Vernon. He is not that type of player. 
that is just a freak that is like a Josh Allen or a Brian Burns or a Montez Sweat that has that athletic ability. And that is why I look towards Quinn and Williams, and Quinn and Williams' upside is just so much higher than Nick Bosa's upside. And that is why I would like Quinn and Williams to be the selection for the San Francisco 49ers. You need a, you got to take the best player available, and Quinn and Williams is that best player available. And Quinnen Williams is going to be a special, special player for the San Francisco 49ers. You have him, DeForest Buckner. D. Ford can be your guy off of the edge. Quan Alexander can also be a blitzing linebacker. Fred Warner can also be a blitzing linebacker. And you can also find speed rushers maybe in the third round, maybe in the fourth round. You can find guys off the edge that are just very good um, in terms of speed and getting to the quarterback. Guys off the edge like a Chris Long, like a veteran that you can find and plug into play.